Hey everybody, welcome to 164 land with another green light unboxing. Once again, all of my sealed cases come from 3000 Toys. Not a sponsored post, but I enjoy the thrill of pulling a green machine, which then forces me to buy the regular separately. Anyway, up now we have the Fire and Rescue Series 3. So in a short amount of time, Greenlight busted out three series of this uh, fire themed set here, which is a mix of new and old um, vehicles, castings, and deco. So, that, and that's for someone who doesn't really collect fire stuff, that's that's the allure is that old school stuff. So, I took a peek in there. I don't think there's any green machines, but we'll see. All right, so first up, you have the FDNY Ford Bronco, which is uh, a, a nice, nice looking truck here. Tires can be a little thicker. It's kind of kind of weird and the caps are annoying they just fall right off that's why uh this little rubber band on there and it looks like the paint doesn't quite match but uh, overall i guess it's uh, i guess it's nice all right next up is the dallas texas fire department and that in this uh, amc matador uh very cool it's very simple it just says battalion chief on the door in very small lettering and other than that, there's not much else to denote the uh, purpose of this vehicle. It's got license plates, which is always appreciated. It's kind of, uh, it's very uh, random as far as uh, which cars get license plates, and this one has it. Also has a nice brown interior, or a tan interior, which is, which, nice, very good. All right, so here we go. A uh, Bullhead City, Arizona. 2020 Ram Tradesman. So this is a, this is a nice looking uh, pickup here. This is the new casting. I really dig when the back is like that. Very, uh, very cool. Mirrors are, eh, they're not too bad. Sometimes they can get a little wonky with these plastic glue-on mirrors, but they're uh, they're not too bad here. Cool design. I uh, I like it. Okay, next up is the Lomb Lombard, Lombard, Illinois. Lombard, Lombard, Illinois. Eh. Oh, it's got a siren on the far side. That's pretty cool. So this is the, uh, this is the 76 Ford Torino. This is the sedan. This casting always kind of throws me off because the back doors are just so tiny. See those tiny little back doors? And I know in uh, in one-to-one -one scale, they are tiny little doors, but this is just a, eh. Not my favorite casting. Uh, looks like this one's got license plates as well. Also, looks like the headlights have a little uh, little tilt to them. And, uh, yeah, otherwise, it's nice. It's got the appropriate size tires there. Cool. All right, two more to go. We have the uh, New Haven, Connecticut. New Haven, Connecticut, West Battalion. So 85 K5 Blazer. Uh, this is again a very sharp, sharp looking truck here. That cap's just gonna fall off. You can see it's just they just don't do well. All right, not much else, uh, no license plates on this one, and not much else to uh, say about it. And finally, all right, this one's this one actually might be the coolest. So, you got the Falston Community Volunteer. Uh, in North Carolina is the 78 Ford F-250 brush truck. So it's jacked up a little. It's got white steel wheels. It's got big tires there. It's got the uh, equipment in the bed, which is the same as the my previous video. You can see here, just painted differently, obviously. Let's put it in front of the camera so you can see it. So very cool. Cool toolings here. I like this one. I like the the front of this Ford and uh, just the whole the deco on the door there very cool I can see this kind of with some patina parked in uh, with a for sale sign in it once it's done its service with like 12,000 miles on it so anyway that's it and that's all thanks for viewing and uh, check back soon for more unboxings